All right, so we're going to go ahead and get started, you guys. Good evening to everyone. Happy Thursday. Hope you've had an amazing week so far. My name is Michelle W. Kofer. I am one of the founding members, actually a regional director with this platform. I'm a mortgage loan originator, guys, and I'm super, super, super excited tonight to talk about our home ownership program that's powered by Debt Clans. Now, when we start thinking about home ownership, uh, drop a one in the chat for me if that was a part of the kitchen conversation when you were growing up. Drop a two if it wasn't. Um, I grew up in the projects to a single mom. Nobody ever talked to me about home ownership, and I just knew you know, that I wanted to own a home one day. And so at 26 years old, I was graced to buy my first house very ignorantly, didn't use a realtor. So I bought a house with bats. Okay. So I inherited an entire problem just because I didn't know. I didn't know what to do. Nobody in my family was a homeowner. And uh, what I discovered years later when I sold my first house to a cash buyer, that there was actually money to be made in real estate. So I used that, I uh, got my second home. And then and guys, uh, even though life happened, I went through eight months of uh, just a financial drought, highly educated, but went through eight months without income and then almost lost my second home. But by the grace of God, I was able to get it sold um, even while in a bankruptcy and again, got money out of the deal. Right. Uh, you know, so just don't 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 believe what your friends say. Right. I was able to uh, get cash out of that deal and I was able to leverage that and later would buy this house that I'm in now. Our interest rate is only 2.25%. We fixed our credit. Uh, we bought this house at a 766. And so I'm super passionate about home ownership because I've been able to see how leveraging the equity from a home can, can actually put your, your family in a different position. Was able to leverage equity to start my very first business um, in 2017. So we start talking about uh, this home ownership program, guys. It's near and dear to my heart. It's something that I'm committed to. And Hopefully you are too. So drop a three for me if you're on the line tonight and you're interested in learning how to be a homeowner. But if you're here learning, wanting to learn how you can become a mortgage loan officer, drop a four. We're going to talk about both a little bit. Uh, won't keep you guys long tonight, but please welcome uh, to our home ownership program, Powered by Debt Clients, guys. We have a really big endeavor over the next five years. Our goal is to go out here, help a million families to become homeowners. We know that for the most part, People cannot own a home because either they're drowning in debt, they have bad credit, or they just don't have the resources or know where to start to get the resources to actually purchase a home. And so through this initiative you're going to hear tonight, we're going to help families dispute debt, eradicate bad credit, and also get them plugged in with the right resources uh, and education around that. And so this mission is on the shoulders of two incredible, incredible businessmen, uh, Mr. George Newberry, a prolific real estate investor who actually experienced hard times himself. Um, one of his apartment units, about a thousand and plus uh, doors, actually end up going under a an ice storm in Ohio. And it subsequently, it wound him $26 million in debt. All right. Now, George didn't file a bankruptcy. He was a smart man. He figured out, how can I get out of debt? How can I get back to controlling my finances? And he created this revolutionary system called Debt Clans. Well, that was 2018, but Debt Clans was only in Chicago. So he partnered with Mr. Chet Seeley, who is also a brainchild, serial entrepreneur, highly successful. And they said, you know what? There's a way that we can take this to the masses. And so the two of them combined, and here you are with this platform tonight. So welcome to Debt Clans, guys. And so I'm not sure if you knew it or not, but there are literally millions of Americans who are struggling uh, to be able to, to even get mortgage ready because they have uh, bad items on their credit, whether it's a foreclosure, uh, evictions, credit inaccuracies, um, auto loans. These are things that are plaguing the average American. And while, you know, the average credit score has risen to a 7-Eleven uh, for the majority, not so much so in minority communities. And so we start to think about what we're looking at tonight, guys. We have the opportunity as mortgage loan officers to get families educated and get them prepared to be a homeowner. And a lot of times that means protecting their rights as a consumer. So this platform offers legal e expertise uh, so that we can protect clients. And the beautiful thing about consumer protection is whether it's fair debt collections, fair credit reporting, RESPA or whatever, if that client has been violated, these attorneys can actually litigate. That client walks away with what? Cash in their hand as a result of that. And now they can use that as earnest money. Now they can use that perhaps as down payment assist, I mean, as down payment on the new house. And so we get excited about it. When we think about home ownership, guys, we know the average interest rates today is about 7.1, 7.4, definitely not a 2.75, okay? But the point is here, 
that buying a home with good credit versus buying a home with bad credit is really the smarter decision. When you look at this example here, you'll see that over the course of a 30 year loan, John is gonna spend upwards $200,000 just because he did not improve his credit before purchasing a home. So we wanna definitely be like Jane, you know, no matter what endeavor we're uh, embarking upon, we want to make sure that this score that is controlling our lives as Americans is actually as high as it possibly can be. And so we know not everybody that wants to buy a house is credit ready. So through this platform, you're actually able to prepare clients. You know, we want them to understand that, hey, getting ready to buy a house, payment history is essential. Over the last 18 to 24 months, we need to be paying every single thing on time, even if it's just the minimum payment. Don't miss a payment at all. But guys, we also have to make sure our clients know not to close accounts. Yes, it's good to pay down debt. We want to get that debt to income ratio down, but do not close those accounts because there you're, you're actually losing 15% of your score. And then we want to make sure also that people understand 10% of that score is new credit. That means don't go apply for anything. Don't co-sign anything. Do not get the car before you get the house. Somebody say amen in the chat. Do not get the car before you get the house because that impacts your score. That's actually up to 55 points. And then again, uh, making sure they have an appropriate mix. And you're going to learn tonight how we even at Debt Clans can help our clients get the right credit profile to get the right score. And then guys, the last part of the credit uh, algorithm is 30%. That's utilization. So we're making sure our clients understand the best place is 10% or lower on your utilization. We have budgeting tools in place to be able to help them because we don't want the credit score stopping them. Oftentimes, you know, it's either their credit score or they have too much debt. So we want to eradicate that to make it a seamless entry into home ownership. Why? Because renting is expensive. Listen, I saw you guys were all from uh, like various parts of the country on here tonight. And so I'm just going to say Atlanta. I'm in the Atlanta area. And so I, I, will, I would venture to guess a two bedroom apartment in Atlanta right now is about $2,300 or more, right? So let's just say it's $1,600, okay? After one year in that one apartment, guess what? That's $19,000 you spent. Five years renting at $1,600, that's $96,000 that the client has spent. That maybe even you on the line, you want to you wanna own a home. You've spent $96,000. 10 years, guys, $192,000 spent. And I'm intentional with that word spent because there's no return on the investment. When you're renting, you're not building legacy. So we want people not to be afraid of market conditions, not to be afraid to buy, guys. We can always refinance. I remember my very first house, my interest rate was at a five point something percent. So you can always wait. What goes up comes down, right? And so we want clients to understand, let's go from renting to owning because renting, quite frankly, is actually expensive and you're not building any equity. It's not an investment. So here are the five stages to home ownership, you all. Uh, number one, we're going to analyze the debt. That's the priority. Let's see what your debt load is looking like. Uh, we have a legal plan specialist in place to be able to assess that. And when a client comes on board, they're going to look at every item on their credit profile, line by line, all three bureaus of guys. And if they need a complimentary debt relief consul uh, consultation, that's provided at no additional cost. Step two is going to be disputing those negative items because we know the fastest way to improve the credit score is get the negative stuff gone, right? Get the negative stuff off and replace it with positive stuff. And so we have a team in place that actually is quarterbacking that every single step of the way. Step three is going to be dispute escalation. Again, going back to these consumer rights. So we do have plan attorneys in place and they're trained to pursue these claims. And so when they go after somebody, they go after. In fact, just last week, uh, one of our uh, partners on here uh, uh, on the call tonight, I'm not going to say his name. He just got over $4,000 in settlement. Less than a month ago, he got another $4,000. One was from Experian and one was, was from the creditors. And so we have people on the line tonight who have actually been able to see uh, uh, $8,600, I want to say, uh, uh, back in settlement, thousands of dollars back in settlement. So this puts families in position to have some extra cash to take with them to the closing table. Now, we also offer expert home ownership assistance. A lot of times, like I said, clients want to buy a home, but they just don't know what to do. They don't know what's the best bank product, which mortgage type. And so we reach people on a diverse uh, spectrum of needs, right? Whether they're low income to high income, we're going to be able to help them. We're going to be able to help people who are uh, self-employed document that income. And then if people need down payment assistance, that's also available through our platform. Now, it's all about future management, guys. Everybody that comes here, you know, uh, may not need credit repair, but if they do, we got them, right? But also understand it's not an overnight process. So every 45 days, if they're needing the credit assistance to qualify, they'll go back through this process. It kicks off again. They're going to assess again any new violations. They're going to take action 
as appropriate. Our clients are in the know. They get to see the letters. They get to see what's on the letters. They get to know what's next steps. They get to see when their scores are going up. They get to see the number of items deleted. Like on this one right here, you see 27 items deleted. The person that invited you tonight can actually add you to our client testimony group. We have an amazing testimony group uh, with phenomenal testimonies, not just about credit guys, but also the settlements and uh, even people who are leveraging our entire platform. Like this week, I just saw someone was able to benefit from uh, our medical platform, $0 for medical uh, coverage for a family of four. So listen, the membership itself, $149.90 for a client, $89 a month. So if you got a client, they're not mortgage ready, here you go. They got legal expert uh, expertise with our attorneys, debt analysis. They got a score simulator. Now my realtor friends, where you at out there? Drop a five. Realtors love the score simulator because it shows them, uh, you know, this client can you uh, insert their cash on hand and it'll show them how it's going to change their score. So we literally can project when they're going to be uh, mortgage ready. They get a million dollars of uh, stolen funds reimbursement. They get all three credit scores. Those are actually FICO. And uh, that piece alone, guys, most people spend about $28, $29 a month for that. It's included in the price here. The attorneys are sending the letters. They don't have to send the letters out. And what I love is that they actually get to report their utilities. Everybody on here that has a light bill, water bill, cable bill, drop me in the chat. Let me see. You got a light bill, cable bill, or water bill. Drop me in the chat. Okay, there we go. I just I just was wondering, am I the only adult on here tonight? Listen, we report those utility bills as well. So this helps our clients build positive payment history. It helps them have a diverse uh, uh, client portfolio. And that $89.95, guys, is actually a positive trade line. It's a credit builder account. So for our clients who have thin files, don't have a lot of history, listen, this helps them. And I know a lot of real estate professionals say, well, the lender don't want to see people been in credit repair before they buy a house. Well, guess what? We're the lenders, okay? So this is an exciting time, guys. Budgeting tool, tax tool, investment tool, student loan solutions, wealth management, all of that is available. Again, $89.95 a month for our clients and no contract, all right? So we're going to switch gears right here. Now, I just want to know who's on the line that wants to make an impact and want to make some money. Drop some dollar signs in the chat because I get excited to talk about this part. Why? Because, guys, I was a struggling social worker. Multiple degrees. I'm highly educated. And listen, I did what they tell you to do in America, which is go to school, get a good education. And I did all of that. And I don't know, maybe just God had his way with my destiny because I ended up in the financial services space seven years now. Uh, helping families with credit, taxes, all of that stuff. That's what I did. And my uh, uh, vision board this year had on it quarter three, 2023, to get my loan origination. And when I was talking to Mr. Seeley uh, about this platform, he said, save your money, it's coming. And I'm like, loan origination? He's like, yeah, it's coming. And guys, less than two and a half, three weeks later, they announced this piece. And I can't tell you, I'm so excited to be able to go out here and really help families in a major, major way. Listen, uh, we're going to talk about some money here in a minute, but I want you to understand it's not about money. What we do is not about money. If you focus on money, uh, you know, maybe this isn't for you, but it's about impact. And if you focus on impact, guys, the income is going to come. I learned that a long time ago. And there are people who will do no work. So we're not promising you anything tonight. Uh, if you don't write any loans, guys, you're not going to make any money, okay? So you got to be willing to learn. You got to be willing to be coached and have uh, the ability to go out here and connect the dots between families that have not and those that want to have, right? So welcome to 75 for All. Um, this is how you can positively impact your community as a mortgage loan originator. So you get to make a difference. Much like I said, as a social worker, I woke up every day, how can I go impact one little Johnny? And that's the same mindset I have. That's the same mindset you need to have. How can I just go help one family a day, uh, one family a week? Listen, as a loan officer, you're connecting families with the appropriate loans. We're making sure they have the right, uh, the right bank product. We're not doing this 2008 stuff. We're just People are getting thrown into all kinds of loans. We want people to get in these homes and they become legacy homes. Put legacy in the chat. We want them to build legacy from these homes, being able to draw equity, start businesses, you know, being able to expand their own last name, right? Uh, we're going to show them how to get access to the resources and we're going to support our borrowers. We're going to hold their hands. But the thing about it, guys, is it's not always been fair and we're actually turning that around uh, through this platform. Racial inequality in our country has existed for centuries, right? And we know that even when it comes to the wealth gap in America, it's actually a, a residual effect of the home ownership gap. And so right now in America, only 44% of African-Americans are homeowners. 49% of Hispanics are homeowners, whereas 
the homeownership ratio for Caucasian Americans is 73%. Now, National Association of Realtors, you guys, they did a study last year on all of the new home buyers in America. And let me tell you something, only 3% of new buyers in America last year were African-American, only three. Only 8% were actually Hispanic American. So that means we have a lot of work to do. And we we fix the home ownership gap, guys. We start closing the disparity between, you know, the wealth gap just in general. And so this is why 75 for all is such a big deal. We're going to bring home ownership rates to 75% for all Americans. So everybody has an equal chance because we know communities that are saturated with, with homeowners are better. They're safer. The schools are better. The resources are are, are, are more vast. And so redlining has held a lot of people out we're turning that around put that in the chat turn around for over you know uh uh, uh what here we got 1934 to 1968 uh that is literally 34 years where all of the government backed loans went to one sector of the, of the community 98 percent went to white families and they either said hey this community right here boom, it's hazardous this community oh it's not desirable so the best communities were, were those that didn't have brown people in them but through this platform we get the opportunity to turn that around as a community loan officer what does that mean that means you live you work you go to church in this community right people already have rapport listen if you know people who want to buy a house put a one in the chat everybody should be lighting it up we got cousins, family members, classmates, people in our church. Everybody wants the American dream. Well, guess what? You get to give it to them. You earn commissions, but you're connecting families who have uh, low to moderate income. You know, we still do jumbo loans, but we're focusing on helping families who've been held back and sequestered, right? Access to FHA, VA, USDA, uh, uh, Fannie Mae product, Freddie Mac. Uh, you know, people can actually qualify with a 580 for FHA. Now, I'm not an advocate of that, but we can't tell our client what to do, what not to do, but we can advise them that it's going to be a better interest rate, right? And so if they're not there, I just told you, you got debt cleanse. And then we also are going to assist families with manual underwriting. So if their loan is kicked off the table, guys, we're going to have that patience and our team is going to go in there and actually manually underwrite to see, can this client really qualify? And if they, if they can, we're going to get them connected. Rehab loans, 203K. Um, if they don't have a social, we got ITN loan products. Uh, we, we even have the help of a loan buddy. People are like, what's a loan buddy? This is a seasoned mortgage loan officer, guys. Yes, we're going to be trained. Yes, we're going to be trained. Yes, we're going to be trained. But we have a seasoned loan buddy at our headquarters bank, Capital Federal, um, out in Texas, who's actually holding our hands as loan officers to make sure these deals are legal, that everything's done uh, to the T, right? And so if, if you're a realtor on the line tonight, go ahead and drop realtor in the chat for me because I got exciting news. As of last December, uh, the conflict of interest rule is no longer an issue. You as a realtor can double dip on FHA bank products. Now, that's exciting news. Y'all have put some dollar signs in the chat for that because super, super, super exciting. So, yeah, you can be the realtor um, uh, and, and the loan officer. And, yes, you can be the realtor and the loan officer on the same transaction. And so that's a new development, guys. But there's always two ways to do anything, right, or multiple ways, I should say. You can go the traditional route and become an MLO. You can have a one-state licensure. You can go take, uh, spend all the money on pre-licensure courses. You can go take the safe exam, and you can probably fail it, 48% pass rate, and that's with people taking it multiple times. Uh, you can pay for renewals and continuing ads and all of that, get licensed one state at a time, and have to have good credit oftentimes to do that. Or you could go the better route. Somebody put better in the chat. The better route is you sign up with the person who invited you on this call tonight, you get trained, you get trained, you get trained, you get a background check, you got to pass that, all right? And you're actually able to originate loans in all 50 states, guys, in a few weeks. We're talking about no state licensing, no state licensing fees, no continuing ed, no annual recertification, no annual recertification fees. No, 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 right? And so as an MLO, you're actually able to empower families multiple times. Say you got a family that's buying right now. Well, great. Let's get them in a home, you know, transition them from renting, but then they can refinance a couple of years later, right? You're going to earn income then, or maybe they want to buy a new house. You can help them again. And so the rush is on guys. We're looking for any and everybody that wants to help, put help in the chat. If you got a heart to help people, we want to partner with you, whether you're in real estate or not, whether you're a teacher, educator, I'm a tax professional, I'm a religious leader, nonprofit, it doesn't matter, guys, what sector of the community you're in. If you like helping people, maybe you're an entrepreneur, you want to scale your business. Guess what? You're a stylist. People that sit in your chair, they, they want to own a home. You own a barbershop. They want to own a home. You have a boutique. They want to own a home. So you're actually able to scale your other business by being a loan officer in the community. And the thing about it, guys, is 
as you see here, the loan officer really doesn't do a lot. If you look at the left side, all you're doing is gathering the paperwork, getting the documents ready, you know, letting the client know what they qualify for. The loan buddy, they're doing the work. They're getting that application done through uh, um, the underwriting system. If it, if it can't be uh, done automatically, they're going to manually underwrite. They're going to be dealing with the difficult questions and situations. They're going to finalize and submit the loan. They're operating uh, within the compliance. They're making sure RESPA is adhered to. They're making sure all the deadlines. All you're doing, guys, is making sure you got the clients that want to buy and that loan officer is going to hold your hand. So here's how you get paid. Somebody put in the chat, show me the money. Let me see if you guys are interested in learning how to get this income, okay? So as a loan officer, you're going to earn basis points. So uh, sometimes referred to as BIPs. So that's anywhere from 100 basis points to 140 basis points. I'm going to slow down. I get really excited, y'all, talking about this. One, 100 basis points is essentially 1%. So let's say you go out there, you help a family, they buy a $350,000 loan. 100 basis points of that for you is $3,500, all right? Now, that's what you earn if you go out there and you do up to $1.99 million in volume that month, you originate that much in loans. Now, if you go beyond that, 2 million to 3.99 mil, you're gonna go to 1.2 basis points, 4 million above 1.4. So that's gonna graduate. Now, I mentioned to you earlier, you have a loan, but they're holding your hands. They're making sure the I's are dotted, the T's across. So on your first 10 transactions, you bring home 65%, they take 35. 11 through 20, you take home 75 they take 25. All right with me. Because guess what? If you're busy like I'm busy, I don't mind. Put the word leverage in the chat. I don't mind leverage. I got other businesses. I got other things I'm doing. Help me, help me. You hear what I'm saying? Okay. So 21 and above, guys, you're bringing home 85%. You taking the money, but they're doing the lion's share of the work. They only keep 15%. Now, you can graduate your buddy or you can keep your buddy. It's up to you. Um, you also have the ability to recruit a team of MLOs. So this is kind of like Keller Williams, EXP, where now you're able to build a team of loan officers. And as they go execute these loans, guess what? You earn 10 basis points on them. So if your loan, but I mean, if your um, partner that you bring on as a loan officer, they did that same $35,000, I'm sorry, $350,000 loan, you just made a passive, hear me, $350. Did y'all hear that? You just made a passive $350 just because you introduced them to the platform, but you also get a bonus pool. So every loan that's originated, $1,000 a month goes back into the pool. So if you had loans originated that month, you can draw from that pool and you actually get to get uh, two entries for people on your front line, your first line of business, and then one for your second and third. So that's even more passive income you earn from the loan officer opportunity. Now, again, I mentioned, guys, you could go get licensed in one state and you could literally get a 50 state play, but it's going to cost you over 50000 or up to $50,000, depending on those state licensures, or you can go to SmarterWay. Like we offer this opportunity tonight, guys, for only $249.90. That gets you all in and it gets you all of the things I mentioned on the front side related to the services. So if you want to invest, that's available. It's a platform here. You want to improve your credit. It's available. You want to learn how to reduce your debt. It's available. Listen, one time set up $249.90. Uh, you do have to pay for your own background check, uh, an NMLS uh, uh, fingerprint check. So right now that's $96.25. You do have to pay for that. And then guys, the membership uh, included uh, is 89 a month. However, you actually get to get that way. Somebody put free in the chat, free, free, free. Refer five people to the platform. It doesn't matter if they're clients in your pipeline. It doesn't matter if they become loan officers. Refer five people. As long as you maintain an active five people, guys, then your services are going to be forever and a day free, all right? So the business is profitable. There's no overhead. Now, when you come on board, especially if you're a realtor, this is going to make sense because we have an amazing AI-driven app called Zenny that's about to come out at the end of the month. As a realtor, not only do you have all of this and you can double dip, but guys, you can actually sit in our app as a realtor and receive round-robin leads that are qualified. That means for those of us that are not realtors, you get to go and sit on a deal as a realtor for our clients. And so you actually get commission for that. But everything, guys, uh, is so inclusive here. You got a legal plan. You got credit restoration, uh, down payment assistance, income documentation. So maybe a person uh, is an Uber driver or, uh, you know, they, they have a side hustle. Well, guess what? Let's help them document that so that income count. Uh, we got mortgage loan origination. Guys, we got title coming. Now you're able to actually earn commission on that. So the same way that George and Chad found a loop around with this, Yes, they were able to do that with title. So you're actually going to be able to offer title in all 50 states. Think about that. You're earning multiple ways on the same client. Property insurance, 
home warranty. We have VR uh, VR viewing. So you actually can have a client in California looking at a house in Florida and it looks as if they're in Florida, but they're not. So we have high technology around that. Maybe you got a client in north side of Atlanta, but they want to see a house in South Atlanta. You can't get there. Well, we can dispatch a concierge to open that house and let them see, see the home. And then also there are health insurance cost reduction. So I love this because guys, a lot of times people have bad credit because of medical bills. They go to an emergency room or, you know, there's a toothache or something and they don't pay it. And so that ends up on their credit. So this company is innovative and says, you know what, we're going to work to prevent that by offering affordable health care to families. And I'm just excited. One of my sisters today, well, yesterday announced that she and her family are actually going to have zero cost medical coverage. We're not talking rinky dink. We're talking about zero cost through this platform and everything hinges on again, five is free. And so when you come on board tonight as an advocate, guys, you have access to all this property casual, everything I mentioned, there's even equity awards. So this company has big vision. George and Chet will take this company uh, 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 to, 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 to the New York Stock Exchange, you know, so there's opportunities for you to get on the ground floor, um, earn equity, earn stock options in this company. And I, I skipped something here I want to share. If you have clients or maybe yourself that don't have a, a banking account, you can actually open an account with our uh, partner, Capital Federal Credit Union, so that people can have access, right? And there are multiple ways to earn even outside of MLO. Uh, mainly, guys, there's active income where you're earning a direct commission from each referral. They're paying $89.95. The company gives you half to 100%, 50% to 100%, pretty substantial. Passive income as you build that team. Uh, residual, that's $14 to $27 a month. That's extremely sizable because I've seen residual comps where you know you maybe earn up to 12 bucks, all right? Uh, there's bonuses. There's a cruise happening right now, incentives, all of that. And I'm going to tell you, none of that means anything unless we are rewriting the narrative. If we're not helping the Damians and the Asians of the world, if we're not helping those clients, like I had two loans to go in this week, if we're not helping those families who, you know, didn't even realize home ownership was a reality, then what are we doing? So we're wanting to go out here, guys, and yes, we're going to make money. It is what it is. It's business, right? But the goal is to make an impact. Hashtag impact. The goal is to make an impact. And so if you're on this call tonight, no matter who you were invited by and you say, I see myself as a part of this mission to help 1 million families, then I want you to get back with the person. I see y'all get back with the person that invited you and say, Hey, I want to be a part of 75 for all. I want to bridge the gap between the haves and the have nots. And I want to be able to say there are more homeowners in my community because I got started as a loan officer and I took those resources out there. So that is our time tonight, you guys. Michelle W. Kofer, um, out of the Atlanta metro area. Super excited about what we're doing. Super late to have all of you on joining the mission tonight. Um, again, get back with a person that invited you. They will let you know how to get started. In fact, you can go ahead and start getting your N NMLS number tonight, guys. It's not it's not a long drawn out process. So get back with the person. Absolutely, you're welcome. Get back with the person that invited you. And guys, we'll see you on the other side. Good night, everybody. Take care. Bye-bye.